contour. This is our loading program. And here we can load anything from policy considerations, proximity, foreseeability, uh, case training simulations, weapons, anything we need. So right now we're in both contract law and torts. Is it really so hard to believe? After all, multiple causes of action have been allowed in England since 1976 with the case Esso Petroleum and Martin. This same approach was adopted by the Supreme Court of Canada ten years later in Central Trust and Refuse. Well, if concurrence is allowed, then why are people trapped in the contractual matrix? Well, the acceptance of concurrency represents an important and necessary improvement in the law of private obligations. The actual effect of the substantive outcome of cases may be more nuanced than appears at first blush. Although, in theory, courts are free to simultaneously entertain several causes of action, in reality, they may refuse to find a tort action or limit a tort action or fiduciary action on the basis of contract. The result may be the same as if the tort action or fiduciary action had never been permitted. This is the world as you know it, in the world of planned transactions and agreed risk allocation that we call the contractual matrix. You've been living in a dream world, Martin. This is the general law as it exists today, of which parties can, if they wish, Welcome to the desert of the general law. There are duties, endless duties, that are not chosen and discussed. They are imposed. For the longest time, I wouldn't believe it, and then I saw it with my own eyes, watched them discuss foreseeability and proximity, and faced with the pure, arbitrary facts, I realized the obviousness of the truth. What is the contractual matrix? Control. The contractual matrix is a set of clauses set to defend against overriding policy concerns such as compensation, deterrence, and loss internalization. It is a system designed to turn human relationships into this. No, no, I don't believe you. It's just not possible. I didn't say it would be easy, Martin. I just said it would be the truth. No, I want to stop. Just let me out of this. 